Right, there's plenty of stuff in the bathroom that can be recycled. So, plastic bottles like these for your, your lotions, you know, after sun, that kind of thing. And also any shampoos and conditioners, you know, for your, yeah. They can go in with your recycling. Deodorants. So that counts for your aerosols and your roll-ons. They can go in. And of course, any lids, take them off. They have to go in your black sack. You've got the uh, hand wash dispensers here. Now, they can go in, but you're going to have to unscrew the top and put that in your black sack. Right, cardboard. Of course, we can recycle that. So your old loo rolls and your toothpaste containers. Chuck those in with your recycling as well. Now, you may be surprised at this. Bleaches and cleaning fluids. You might consider those as hazardous materials, but actually they're not. These can go in with your recycling. But remember, of course, to take the lids off, any of these nozzles, any sprays, tops, take those off and put those in the black sacks. Right, things you can't recycle. Blister packs for pills. I'm afraid there are no black sack. Also any tubes. So toothpaste tubes, uh, makeup tubes and whatever these are, they go in your black sack as well. Finally, something very important to talk about. Nappies. Now, under no circumstances should these be put in with your recycling. Even if it says that they are biodegradable. Always, always put them in the black sack. Right. I think we're done here. Time to take the sacks out. Each week, take out both sacks before 7am on the day of collection. And if you have a disability or an illness, you can contact the council for the assisted collection service.